Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I am going to be shutting the window because I forgot. Sorry about that. But in today's video, I'm going to be doing my May natural hair favourites. So it's the end of the month. Perfect way to end the month by telling you all my favourite products of this month. Some of them I've tried new this month. Some of them I've just revisited and realised that it's a favourite. So, without further ado, let's get straight into the video. First on my list is none other than As I Am's Hydration Elation. I really feel like this product does not get the love that it deserves. Like, I remember hearing about it, reading about it in like natural hair blogs, seeing other people use it. But the hype that it gets is not big enough. I used it for the first time months ago. And when I first used it, I did think it was great. I was thinking, oh, it's really easy to detangle. It feels really nice, all that kind of stuff. But for some reason, because I think it's because I use quite a lot at once. That would be one downfall. Because the tub is so small, I end up using like half the tub in one wash. So I think I didn't revisit it because I didn't want it to run out too soon. But then when I did revisit it, and I actually used a different method. So the first time I just did it outside the shower, which is what I usually do. But the second time I did it while I was still in the shower with all the steam. And that literally melted all the nuts out of my hair. Like, ugh, I fell in love, honestly. So the point, I literally went and bought another one straight away. So this one is nearly finished. I could probably get half a section out of this. And then my new one has not been opened yet, but I couldn't run out, I refuse. So yeah, this product is amazing. Highly recommend, it's a great deep conditioner. I might even go as far as to say it's my favorite deep conditioner, maybe. If it's not my favorite, it's definitely top three, no doubt. But yeah, amazing deep conditioner and definitely number one May favorite. The next product I have to show is Meow or Meow, I'm not sure how you pronounce it to be honest. It's the Rosemary and Mint Scalp and Hair Strengthening Oil. Um, it has infused with biotin encourages hair growth to be honest the only reason i used it i'm not really big on oils i should be because i've got like really high prosthetic hair so i should be using oils to seal it in like all the moisture but i'm not but i've had quite bad scalp the past few months like i don't know what's been going on with my scalp it's just been really dry really itchy and i've been using this now and again whenever the itch is like a little bit intense but i'm not actually going to wash it yet i'll use this and i do feel like it kind of soothes that itch just a little bit i've been using this quite a lot and that is a big deal for someone that doesn't really use oils so while I don't think it's necessarily a staple I do like this for at the moment like it's one of my favorite products for me <laughs> next on my list is probably going to be my product favorites if I continue this monthly if you want to do this monthly let me know in the comments this product is absolutely bay oh my god I think I discovered it a couple of months ago now um but again I've got two of these because I can't run out I just refuse this one's like less than half and this one is a new one it's the Camille Rose moisture milk absolutely amazing I do feel like you have to apply it quite heavy for me personally anyway again though I do have high porosity hair so that might be why my hair just like sucks up all the moisture but this leaves my hair so so soft I, like I could do a twist out with this. I won't necessarily get the most definition because it's not holding products, but in terms of moisture, I'm getting it with this, amazing. Probably my favorite leave-in. In fact, no doubt about it, so far, this is my favorite leave-in that I've ever tried. Yeah, favorite leave-in that I've ever tried. I can literally style my hair just using this. I can do twist outs, braid outs, just using this. And I know my hair's gonna be moisturized after, so strong words, but favorite leave-in at the moment, ever. I'm not going to lie, I am a big fan of Camille Rose products in general. Um, I know some, it's a bit hit and miss for some people, but I will say they do have to apply quite generously. So if you try the products and not like them, maybe try like using a lot more and then seeing if you still don't like it. And if you still don't like it, I don't know. It works for me. So yeah, next on the May favourites list is actually not a hair product, but it's a hair tool. And that is the Denman powder brush. It's a little bit dirty, so I don't want to show the bristles. But I actually won this in a Denman giveaway that they did with Living Proof living proof products here which i haven't used yet i need to do wash and go with it but i've been dreading it i'm not gonna lie but yeah i won this in a giveaway i've never actually had a paddle brush before like ever um and i realized that i'm missing out on quite a lot it makes it so easy to detangle especially when i've just deep conditioned my hair rather than going in with a little tiny brush which is what i used to do this paddle brush will just get through larger sections at once so and plus it, i don't feel like it snags my hair too much so i really do like this Again, I ain't trying to show the bristles, but this is one of my main favorites as well. Favorite hair tool this month, for sure. Okay, this was a very, very quick video. I think I'm speeding through it, but last on the list is another As I Am product, and it's from their Lung and Looks line, and it's the Curl Enhancing Smoothie. 
I mostly use this product whenever my hair is blow dried. So as you can see, my hair was, well, it was actually blow dried and one curled. And then I did Bantu nuts to kind of just keep the curl because it was falling out. But whenever I've got um, my hair blow dried and I need to moisturise it, this is what I use because it's more of like, it's like a thicker consistency rather than wet. So it doesn't revert my hair too much, but it still provides quite a lot of moisture. So whenever I'm doing something to my hair, I always, and it's blow dried, I always use this. So highly recommend this even when i'm not blow drying my hair to be honest i've got i use this to do a twist out before which is, i think is on my channel so my three strand twist out i use this as well as the grow yogurt i got really good results my hair was really soft and really defined as you can see in that video i'll link it in in the top the reason why this one is in my may favorites is because at the moment my hair's blow dry so i've been using it to do my bantu knots but yeah love this highly recommend a little bit expensive but you need you need all of these products to be honest if i had to pick like two favorites it would be hydration elation and moisture milk if you only go out and buy two products make it be these two i promise you your wash day is going to be like completely different level this will help you detangle like mad and this you just you'll be reaping the benefits the next day i promise so yeah very quick video today sorry if i sped through it too fast i'm literally speaking so fast i can barely keep up i can barely keep up with myself as you can see so also sorry before i leave guys do you like my light or not <laughs> so if you got me on instagram you know i bought this light a few months ago it was a lot of money i'm not gonna lie i do actually have a discount code now because quite a few people was asking so i was like can i get a discount code and they were like yeah sure so anyways long story short i've got a discount code which is sab danielle 15 for 15 percent off my light cost 250 pounds which included shipping um it's got one year warranty all that kind of stuff honestly i don't regret it because the customer service was absolutely amazing and the light is stunning and at night time i literally turn on my lights off just have this light on and it's a vibe a complete vibe you need it but aside from that do you like my light i really like it i also like this little setup so i think this is going to be my little youtube setup from now on thanks for watching guys and i'll see you in the next video Mwah. <laughs>